All right, guys, welcome back to HFC Games. Quick video today because a brand new firmware update just launched for the Samsung Odyssey G7 gaming monitor. I've covered that extensively on the channel before. So yeah, new firmware today. Uh, so let's talk about that real quick. Go to download. I've got a new bin file, so we're gonna drop that onto our desktop. And uh, let me just see if we can find notes for this. So again, very frustrating. No patch notes on the website. I said this before, I do not understand why they don't do it. But anyway, for you guys, what I'll do is I'm gonna update the firmware and let's check out the menus to see if there's actually any new features added or is this just simply another patch update per se. So as always, you get your bin file and we're gonna drop that into a USB drive. This one is formatted to app 32 So copy in the bin file there, you can put it onto the root of the directory and then we're gonna slot that into the Samsung Odyssey G7. So guys, as before, I'm gonna show you the menu. I'm gonna go to menu. USB drive is obviously in the monitor and what we're going to do is go down to support, software update, it should search the USB drive, remember it needs to be formatted to FAT32 and as you can see my previous version was 1011 and now it's ready to update to 1013 and hit yes and give, let it do its thing, make sure you do not lose power or power off, it could break the device so just be wary of that. Okay, so guys, then if you want to check, confirmation, the monitor has rebooted, go to menu, go down to support again and go to information just to confirm first the version. So you can see now the software version is 1013.2. So let's see if now if there's any features added to the menu. But guys, what I will do is um, I continue to look online if I see anything in regards to uh, patch notes, etc. I will be the first to update my video uh, in the notes and the description with any details I find. But as of now, it does look as if it's just essentially uh, bug fixing, patch, and no functionality added. So uh, I will update. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate the support, and I'll see you in the next video.